Alright, let's get into it with Decadence. I, Anita, take you, Dean, to be my husband. For better, for worse, in sickness and in health, till death do us part. Hmm. Turn up the sensitivity. I okay. You have one new message. Hey, honey, I'm coming home from work soon. Had to stay late to finish. Can you set the table on the counter before you settle in? Anniversary is the twelfth. Wait, the fifteenth only. Probably. Don't know. Yeah, that it's pretty ominous. All right, set the table. Place. What am I placing? Get a cup. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, you can do multiple. All right. Sound like it was right next to me. Hi, sweetie. I can't Hello. seem to find my ring. Can you find it and place it next to my jewelry box? Again, honey? You keep on forgetting. Oh, stop complaining. I was running late for work. Hmm. Uh, okay. We'll do it now. <sighs> Thank you, Dean. I'll be home soon. Wait, what? It's a wired phone, and I'm pretty far with that. Uh, jewelry box. Bathroom. Hi. Bedroom. There we go. Place. Oh, wait. I don't have the ring. I was like, wait. Gotta find it. Now, where did she put that ring? She was in a rush. It might be in the bathroom. Oh. Place it at the corner, or maybe the can you not? What the fuck happened here? Nothing. What the? Oh, there you go. This is the second time this week. Second time have to clean this up before she gets home. What? That's the second time. The first time is where you should be wondering. Throw it away. Where the hell's your trash? Oh, oh my god. Dean, I forgot my keys. Can you unlock the back door for me? The back door? Hey, PT. Oh, hey, Dean. Can you clean the mess you left in the living room? You left your books all over the table. I did? What mess? <sighs> Fine. Give me a second. This is messy. Can I go this way? Oh no, messy. Stephen King control. Ooh, someone needs to use code keys. Alright, do that. Over here. There you go. There we go. What? 
I think I can go for some fresh air. Well, you are. There is a little mold here, so. Okay. What was that? Can you check it out? I'd rather not. Yeah, the mold's getting back here, brother. Oh, she okay. likes to see us a gift. Let her hide it in the closet before she gets home. No. Yeah, that pillow has been moving. Oh, God. Oh. Alright. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. I'll, I'll move it. Okay. Not now. I need space to breathe, please. You're suffocating me. I, okay. Come out here and talk to me. No. Assertive. Let's finish talking. Open the damn door. Okay, relax. I'm sick and tired of your shit. I said leave me alone. No, I... Okay, okay. I swear, he was here. I, I heard her. No wonder you're leaving the bathtub. You're leaving the bathtub. Full. Okay. All right. Can go this way. Hmm. Dear Dean, we hope this letter finds you well. We are writing to address a matter that has come to our attention regarding your recent absence from work for six days without prior notice or explanation. As an integral part of our team, your presence and commitment to your responsibilities are crucial for smooth operation of this company. I need to hire someone else. We kindly request that you provide us with an explanation for your absence during the specific, specified period. This will enable us to understand the circumstances surrounding your absence and explore potential ways to address any challenges you might be facing. To avoid any negative impact on your professional development and overall functioning of our team, we kindly request that you adhere to our attendance policy moving forward. We encourage you to schedule a meeting with your manager, Juliet, at your earliest convenience to discuss your recent absence and any underlying concerns you may have. Thank you for your attention to this matter. Arthur. Okay, then. Funeral. I, I mean, I guess you might be then, but that was. Oh, yes. Okay, I must say it says the actual date on it prior to what I said, but that it's new. Oh. Okay, should I turn it off? Can I turn it back on? Wait. Cores, Heineken, yeah. Recipes. Huh. No. Ooh. Are you scared? What's that? Moving day. We're not the first to live in the apartment, in this apartment, and we won't be the last, but we'll be the ones who never leave. Well. Okay. You need to do your laundry there, bro. Ooh, the... There again. Alright, on next. Close it. Fuck off. Seems to be tampered with. 4, 13, 81. 81. Nope.
Hope this letter finds you and your family in good health during this challenging time. Please accept my sympathies and know that my thoughts and prayers are with you and your family as you navigate through this difficult period. As your turn, it's my responsibility to assist and guide you through legal matters pertaining to your blank. I understand that this is a distressing and emotionally overwhelming time. And I am here to provide you with necessary information and support to ensure a smooth and efficient resolution. In the upcoming days, I kindly request you to schedule a meeting with you. Uh, I kindly request you to schedule a meeting at your earliest convenience. This meeting will allow you to discuss necessary legal procedures, including probate, asset distribution, and any other legal matters associated with your wife's estate. In the meeting, I'll provide you with a comprehensive overview of the steps involved and answer any questions or concerns you may have. Sincerely, Rebecca Smith. Kirkland and Cole Law Firms. A little, little blood on there. No oh, anniversary coming up. When is she? July twenty six. Nineteen eighty six. Right. Nineteen eighty three. Oh, we're oh, three years. Fuck. Okay. Shows how much I pay attention. This acting's pretty good. Oh, okay. That one. Taking them all. Get you the one I want is gonna open. JK. Jesus Christ. Can we uh talk about this? our anniversary nothing oh god can we change the song to something more up like uppity I don't know oh wait am I crazy I'm probably crazy that I lost her. Oh, oh, never mind. You look as beautiful as you did four years ago. Oh, wait, is she? I'm sorry, Alita. I can't let you go. Oh, no. We'll be together forever. Even death could do us part. Together forever. Together forever. Yeah, that was got a little jumpy here and there, but yeah, I mean, it's my fault. I didn't get some of the uh, um, story right then and there, but no, this was a uh, like a graduation project. So that was a good job. Wherever you are, hope the best for you. On to the next one.